Good morning. It's Friday, April 28th. Thanks for closing out your week with Top Story. If you're hunting for more great news and stories, look no further. Check out the full World Watch show. Now, this is Top Story. Argentina's currency is sliding out of control, and the government may be forced to devalue it. That is, make its money worth less on purpose. The currency exchange rate between dollars and pesos is officially controlled by the government, but the black market has created a different exchange rate, and the gap between the two is widening. Vendors can't adjust their prices fast enough to keep up with inflation. The employees are making new signs with prices every day. It's crazy. Argentinians spend their wages as soon as they can or exchange them for other currencies. If they hold on to the money, its value will have dropped by the next week or even the next day. The Argentinian president may be forced to additionally devalue his country's currency to match the black market exchange rate. And yes, the black market rate is illegal, but the government can't manage to control it. So the black market rate has become an established part of Argentina's economy. Devaluing the peso could help reduce the trade deficit and boost exports, but it would slash the value of people's savings and further raise prices. We're told this generation is distracted, disconnected, and apathetic. But when they learn to see everything from the truth of Scripture, their faith flourishes and they live lives of purpose. Headlines can be scary. Talking about them with kids doesn't have to be. Introducing Concurrently, the News Coach podcast from God's World News. Let's teach children with calm discernment. Make sure you head over to that full World Watch site. That's worldwatch.news forward slash free video. We're actually going to give you the show free for a whole week. Well, thanks for watching, everybody. I'm the Big Bash. Remember, whatever the news, the purpose of the Lord will stay.